the iPod is 20 years old. 20. Back then, I'm sure you were um, very likely in class, sitting in the back with uh, with uh, with the earpiece, uh, uh, listening. You know, you know, you're listening to music, but you know, you're in class, not actually paying attention. We've we've all been there and done that. You've listened to it in the car while driving or socially when you're with friends. Uh, that was 20 years ago. When I look at the images and the videos and the ads of uh, uh, the old iPod, it, it triggers you know a warm feeling uh, because this period was because music for me uh, means a lot. I spend a lot of time listening to music uh, and the retro tech bit, how it was designed, the the audio, the uh, the artwork, and so on. So that uh, has a precious part for me even since then, and also a part that. Uh, Breaks my heart a little bit. A lot of my friends, we used to listen to a lot of music together and so on. And as they grew older, they lost interest uh, in music and uh, and that uh, uh, and that and they're listening to, to, to less music. And I think that's that's also another casualty of of us becoming uh, adults. Um, on Spotify, I use public playlists. So if you want to look at what what I listen to, if you search for uh, Ayman Aitania on Spotify. Uh, music I share is usually electronic and dance uh, or retro uh, or chill out house. I personally judge people based on their music. So this is a great opportunity for you to take a look and judge and gossip uh, about why I've chosen this particular song out of there, especially with the retro bit. So with that, I leave you with wishes of good music in your home, in your office and your AirPods. Thank you for joining.